What's going on guys and welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be doing the fifth spray off challenge that I've done on this channel. That's right, I've done four before this and if you haven't checked those ones out, I'll make sure to put a little tab up somewhere in this video so you guys can go ahead and check out all of those. Now, I will say all of those were sneeze fests and this one's probably going to be a sneeze fest, but I got my little coffee K-cup guys, all right? So I'm going to be sniffing this throughout just to clear my sinus palate so uh, it could be you know I guess I could just clear it out just clear my sinuses up I guess okay um, so if you guys don't know what the spray off challenge is pretty much I have a set of fragrances you spray one uh, you spray both of them at the same time and then you see which one you can smell first the one that you can smell first wins and that goes into the winner's pile the one that you cannot smell first when you spray them both off at the same time goes into the loser's pile and you just keep going down the line until you whittle your way down or until I whittle my way down until the final two so there's going to be three rounds the first round is going to be comprised of eight fragrances both split up into pairs and then the second round is going to be four fragrances split up into twos and then the final round we're going to have the last two all right guys sounds simple enough now I have eight fragrances here some are niche some are designer and we're just going to go ahead and get started. Uh, I'm just going to apologize in advance if I start sneezing like crazy. But you guys already know how it is. So let's get started. So for the first two guys, for the first round, the first two fragrances are going to be Cidrat Bose Eau de Parfum and Chocolate Greedy Eau de Parfum by Montel Paris. So are you ready? All right, I'm ready, guys. All right, three, two, one. Chocolate greedy. Chocolate greedy. All right, guys. So, Cedrat Blase goes into the loser's pile, and uh, Chocolate Greedy goes into the winner's pile. All right, guys. We got Mwaj Figment Man, and we also have Hindu Kush by Mansara. Oh, gosh. I see. I'm going to sneeze again. <clears throat> but we're going to get this coffee going. Sniffing that up real good. All right, guys. Are you guys ready? I'm ready. All right. Three two one okay we got that emouage figment man okay that one won so that one's gonna go into the winner's pile hindu kush is gonna go into the loser's pile guys it smells crazy in here already that dirt smell with the hindu kush that was actually that's actually an interesting smell i should probably try to layer that although i don't layer i should probably try guys all right guys are you ready all right, we got Burberry London for Men, EDT, and we got Halloween Man X. I believe this is an Eau de Parfum, guys. All right, you guys ready? All right, I'm ready. Three, two, one. Definitely, definitely Halloween Man X. This is a coffee joint, guys. It smells really good. That's going to go into the winner's pile. Burberry London for men, you gotta go to the loser pile. All right, guys. So for the final two for the for the first round, we're gonna have Cartier's Declaration Parfum, and we're gonna have Amber Oud uh, Tobacco Edition, guys, by Al Harmain. All right, guys, are you guys ready? All right, I'm ready. Three, two. Let me sniff this coffee real quick. All right. <laughs> Three, two. One. Cartier Declaration Parfum, guys. All right, guys. So that's the first round. So we got Cartier Declaration Parfum. We have Halloween Man X. We have Emouage Figment Man. All right. And we have chocolate greedy by montel paris okay so we're gonna go with for the second round here we're gonna go with amouage figment man and cartier's declaration parfum guys now we're gonna sniff this coffee real quick all right guys you guys playing along with me you guys playing along i hope you guys are all right all right three two one Surprisingly enough, 
I get Cartier's Declaration Parfum. That's going to go into the final round, guys. Figment Man's got to go to the loser's pile. All right, guys. So for the final round of round number two, we have Montel's Paris Chocolate Greedy, and we have Halloween Man X. Let's go ahead and sniff this coffee real quick. All right, guys. Are you guys ready? You guys playing along? All right. All right. Three, two, one. Chocolate greedy, guys. Wow. Chocolate greedy is a nice chocolate orange. If you guys haven't watched my first impression, you should go check that out. I'll probably put a card up here somewhere. Okay, guys. So for the final round, the final round, we got, see, I'm about to sneeze again. We have Cartier's Declaration Parfum, and we also have Montel's Chocolate Greedy. <clears throat> Gosh, man. I don't know why I do this. Okay, we coffeeed up. This is the final round. Which one do you guys think is going to win? I think I have an idea. Okay. All right, guys. We got Chocolate Greedy and Cartier's Declaration Parfum. All right. Three. Two, one. Surprisingly, guys, it was Montal's chocolate greedy. If you haven't, if you haven't watched my first impressions on this, I believe it was the first impression, guys. Someone's really gourmand chocolate. It smells edible when you wear this. I actually wore this yesterday. <clears throat> That's my scent of the day, and it lasted forever. <clears throat> I just want to eat myself all day long and guys if you wear this this one is totally unisex but if guys if you wear this you're gonna get compliments a lot from the females guys ladies love this stuff they actually want to wear this <laughs> they want to wear it because you know it smells like chocolate it smells like candy just very sweet very gourmand almost realistic almost kind of comical that it smells like real chocolate but guys this one's also good I'm still testing it out, guys, for a review. But I will have uh, my top 10 fall list on Friday. So look out for that, guys. I will be posting it this Friday. That's right. So hold me to it this Friday, top 10 fall list. All right. I know you guys have been wanting that. Also, I just did a live stream with Ben. Uh, his channel is That Cologne Guy. So I will leave that link to the description uh, of that live stream I did on Saturday with him. We chopped it up for about an hour and 20 minutes. He's a really cool guy. I love his channel, and you guys should just go check out that live stream. We talked about a lot of stuff, including some horror movies we had recently seen over the weekend, guys. So uh, thank you guys so much for watching this channel. I hope you guys like that spray off challenge. And uh, I got some more stuff, like I had just previously mentioned, coming your way. So uh, thank you so much for watching Lock Sense. I'm your host, Dr. Go. I'll catch you guys later. Please stay safe. Enjoy your life and do the best job you can and anything that you put your mind to, guys. All right? I'll see you later. See ya.